today I'm filming the video that you guys rioted that I didn't film last year, which I'm sorry, I just felt a little strange filming it because I'm at that point I was 25, now I'm 26, and I was like, is this like an appropriate video for like somebody my age to be posting? But apparently it is. You guys were like very keen on me posting it, so here we are. I'm not gonna go into the huge disclaimer that everyone does because you've heard that enough. And unlike everyone else, I am bragging. No, I'm just kidding. Honestly, this year asked for just like stuff, like gift cards for a future home because we are about to start the home buying process and it makes me wanna like vomit every time I say that because like the amount of money that's going to go. I like to hoard my money. <laughs> Unfortunately, you can't hoard your money forever. You can't go to the grave with it. That's mainly what I asked for. When Cody and I do presents, we like to like go big for Christmas. For some reason we don't go big for like anniversary or Valentine's Day, but for Christmas, man, we do it. So this year my Christmas present from Cody is still in England. <laughs> it's still getting shipped. Missed Christmas, but it's okay. I can't wait to show it to you guys when it does get here. Um, I'll give you a little hint. It's something I've wanted since uh, 2007 or something like that when it first came out. We'll leave you with that. But this year we got so many good gifts and obviously I gotta show it to you guys because that's what you guys want. So without further ado, let's go ahead and hop into this bragging video. Okay, so the big present this year from my mom and dad, even though they don't have to get me anything, my mom wanted to make sure it was something that I truly, truly wanted and that I'd wear. So I asked for my Ghani boots that I wanted since the summertime. You guys, I own three pairs of Ghani cowboy boots and I love them all, um, but especially my blue ones and then now these ones. I think they're just such a statement. They're so pretty and I love them so much. I originally had an outfit on on Christmas day to wear with these and I had my hair crimped and I literally looked like a wannabe Taylor Swift from 2011. Not the vibe. And obviously like what girl doesn't like to buy themselves presents for Christmas? This year I only bought myself one thing and I got these the other day and I've already got a freaking scratch in them and that pisses me off. My brother has called these my nun shoes which is just so lovely. They are these Gucci platform shoes. They're black and gold and I have wanted these since the summer as well. I was not trying to spend the full retail price on them because I was like, I truly don't know what size I am, how often I'd wear them, but I often find that this was something that was missing from my closet, like a loafer, something I could wear with socks. Like all I have for the winter time are boots or sneakers like there's no in between so this is something that i was really really excited for um i found them for a really really good price they run extremely extremely small i had to get a size 40 and even then my feet are like squish but they're really cute that's the tea on those those are my nun shoes as my brother calls them then from my best friend caitlin she saw on my stories when i was promoting the shop bop sale that i posted this bag and i said somebody could slap me across the face and i'd be like with this bag and I'd be like please do it again. So I guess she took that as I'm gonna get that for Sarah because I can slap her in the face with it. So thank you so much Caitlin the Glamorista 16. I love this. I've already worn it with one of my outfits that I'm going to be posting on my Instagram soon but it is just such a fun bag and I love all the bags that Susan Alexandra Alexandra yeah does. I think they're so cute. You can buy them on Shopbop. Oh, they're stunning. I'm like not going in any particular order. My aunt got me this cool bag for all like putting in my car and helping bring in groceries, which is like such a practical present that honestly will love and cherish because I usually use my Ikea bag to bring in stuff from my car. Um, but this is so much smaller and more practical than an Ikea bag, especially for groceries. Stuff from Cody, he got me another macrame owl. And then from my parents, everything fits in a bag, which is super easy, at least from opening presents on Christmas morning. My mom is so cute, and she doesn't want us to, like, not have something to open. Like, she feels bad just giving us money or something like that. So she wrapped, <laughs> this is the cutest thing ever, she wrapped every gift card with a thing of candy in a box and then we had something to unwrap. I got a McDonald's gift card because it's like my favorite restaurant and some Bark Thins. And then Trader Joe's peanut butter, dark chocolate peanut butter cups with a gift card to Trader Joe's. What a gem. And as I said, I was asking for a lot of gift cards this year because, uh, the whole home thing and my brother got me a home depot gift card and this one has a puppy on it 
Oh, she's cute. And it says Miller and Family from Buster, which is his dog's name. So, thank you. My final Christmas morning gift was from Cody. He got me a bunch of little anthropology ornaments because obviously my main gift didn't arrive in time. So he got me this little polar bear. This little angel. This guy. So cute. Moving on. So then our next Christmas destination for exchanging gifts is at his mom's house. There's some really cute stuff. So his mom always gets like really meaningful stuff. Like she puts like a lot of thought into it. And I really appreciate that. Last year she got us like a Miller cup, which was so cute with like his face all over it cutest thing ever this year she got his and hers planters for future home this one is going to be cody that's what she said and this one okay so she has two of these small ones for like succulents but there's like a bigger one which will be right next to that one which will be me i love that so thank you and buddy the elf candle and it smells really good so she also got me tabasco jelly beans <laughs> They taste like Tabasco. It's weird. It's kind of like an experience. Something I probably wouldn't recommend to people to eat as candy, but I tried them while I was there. I was like, wow, this is Tabasco. So then she got Cody and I both one of these, and I was like, are these like beer bottle things? But they're not. Are you ready? These are the things you put in your vents of your car when you're traveling on road trips to put the sauces, like a Chick-fil-A sauce right there, and you can dip. Yeah. This was like low-key my like favorite gift I received because I love my chicken nuggets and I love my french fries and I love my McDonald's and my Chick-fil-A and all that other really healthy stuff I love. So Cody and I both got one of these. Mine's already in my car because hello. Cody's sister got me some candy. My two favorite candies. I love octopi and then fast breaks are actually one of my favorite chocolate candies. I feel like they're so underrated. Let me know your thoughts. And then she got me the cutest, softest sweater, which is actually one of my favorite colors to wear. I don't own enough green, which I love, like I said, to wear. Um, I think it's a really f color, good color for my, my eyes. This one's so soft and so cozy. And then Cody's grandma got us both Lowe's gift cards, which that's gonna be used. Gonna be so nice, like honestly, to help ease the burn of buying all that practical stuff that you need um, when you do buy a home um, and then she also gave me three candles which are amazing i'm gonna crack open them because the christmas season's not over christmas cookie cody's definitely gonna steal this one i'm gonna probably burn this one first so that completes my what i got for christmas video i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you guys did be sure you stick around by subscribing if you guys are interested in the home buying process a lot of my videos are going to be about that in the new year because that's currently where we are in my life adulting my legs have fallen asleep oh i don't like that so until next time i will talk to y'all later bye